Today I'm going to show you how I made my homemade charging system on my tractor to power all my lights, my horn, and my fan It's going to be in place. So what I did was I mounted a pulley on the engine, took the cover off, and there was three bolts I could pull a pulley in, drilled a hole, three holes, and... Uh, made that and then I went to the auto parts store and got an alternator and I wired it up to the external regulator and it runs on pulley drive so um, and the battery used to be right here but I bent that up and stuck it back here. And when I want to turn it on, instead of the key switch turning it on, I have a switch right here. There's an alternator. That I'll flick on and then you can turn it on or off. And I'm going to put a belt tensioner probably right here connected to that thing. And then I'll tension it like that. Connect the spring over it here. That should work. But this is a good method um, if you want to add lights and stuff to your tractor. Um, it doesn't hog too much power or anything. The way I set this mount up was I just got a piece of steel right here and I drilled a hole where the gas tank was. And uh, this was where the mount was on the alternator, so it was just an easy mount and on the other side I got a piece of metal I bent it uh, I can't really see it but I bent it into like a C formation to fit around the alternator mounting holes then I went to Home Depot got some bolts bolted it on and that's how I mounted that side and it swivels so you can tighten it depending on the belt length you just have to undo this um, and that's it it works really good so see you next time